deceptions. Of course, I was drugged, and so heavily I did not regain my consciousness till the next morning. I was horrified to discover that I had been ruined, and for some days I was inconsolable, and cried like a child to be killed or sent back to my aunt. Mayhew, London Labour and the London Poor. Even so distant, I can taste the grief, bitter and sharp with stalks he made you gulp. The sun's occasional print, the brisk, brief worry of wheels along the street outside where bridal London bows the other way. And light, unanswerable and tall and wide, forbids the scar to heal and drives shame out of hiding. All the unhurried day your mind lay open like a drawer of knives. Slums, years have buried you. I would not dare console you if I could. What can be said, except that suffering is exact, but where desire takes charge, readings will grow erratic? For you would hardly care that you were less deceived out on that bed than he was, stumbling up the breathless stair to burst into fulfilment's desolate attic.